when you were a baby, you didn't have much awareness of change and this and that. But you started going to school and things changed. Where all the people you really knew were the people that you came across every day, your mom, your dad. Now all of a sudden there's all these other people. And you start learning, you have to interact with them and you have to be submissive, you have to be assertive and somebody might come along and take your book and somebody might do something and do something and do something and you have to be nice and you have to be this and you have to be that. Things change. It's not a severe realization, it happens pretty gradually. Then comes that time when now you can have a driver's license. And you feel like some sense of accomplishment. Now things have changed. And these are all kind of nice change. But then comes that other change. You realize. <clears throat> there's a new smell in the air. That you never smelt before. And. The body is not performing the same way. And there are so many people who want to hang on to their youth. When the body itself doesn't want to hang on to it. Done. There is, there is a big difference, my friends, in being healthy, staying healthy, and trying to look like who you are not. You get it? There's a big difference. Because what is a presentation of that which you are trying to hide, which is inevitable? It's going to happen. It's going to happen. Slowly, things are going to change. And this change has been afoot. This change started when you took your first breath. Not before that. When you took your first breath, this entire change started. Now, I know everybody's like, whoa, Heavy stuff. It's not heavy stuff. It's nature. This is how it does it. It's for everything. Trees will age. Even rocks. Mountains. You look at some mountains and they're nice and soft. Right? And you look at the other mountains and they're sharp and all, you know, edgy and, you know what, why? One is the old mountain, one is the new mountain. The new one hasn't had the chance to get softened. That's neither good nor bad. It has nothing to do with it. It is just how it is. I say to people, I say, do you know that somewhere on this planet Earth, the sun is rising always? And it is setting 
always, this process of sunrise and sunset is continuous. It doesn't feel like that to us, does it? We look out, oh, the sun is up, oh, let's go. But if you have ever looked at a sundial, What it's really showing you is it's constantly moving, slowly, but absolutely. So is your life, so is your body, so is this time, so is all of this. It's in constant motion. You don't want that. You want, you want to have a little pause button, get to that one nice point and go, ta-da! I want to stay here. But that's not how it is. So in this change, is there any certainty? Because change can bring another element into it, which is uncertainty. You don't know where you're headed. What does this change actually do? Well, there is a certainty. And the certainty is your ability to enjoy will not diminish, even with age. Your ability to feel gratitude will not diminish, even with age. Your ability to be happy will not change, even with age. Your ability to have clarity in your life will not change, even with age. Provided, provided you have made those things the core of your life.